Okay, Cammy, your second hat trick of the season. How do you feel about that? Yeah, good, good, good. I mean, obviously, thankfully, I'm happy that the goals helped us, obviously, towards the win. We needed a second one to go in to sort of give us to ease off our pressure second half and luckily yeah it went in. What did you think about the side's performance overall? It was it was fairly dominant wasn't it? Yeah I mean I think obviously the sending off was obviously a bit harsh but that that, that happened obviously he handballed it and um, I think it's sort of just changed the game for us. The second half obviously it was a bit easier obviously with a man extra but we have to just keep concentrating and then keep you know implying what the manager wants us to do and that's what we've done second half. You obviously the first uh, goal was uh, from the penalty spot as well. Yeah. You missed that one against Wrexham. So yeah. was there a bit of nerves there at all? Um, tiny bit, tiny bit. But obviously we're forwards. At the end of the day, you know, you have to sort of just move on. You know, you're going to get a lot of moments where you miss. Obviously, you see players at the top, they miss, they go again. So had to just concentrate and, you know, luckily it went in. Um, do, do you, uh, obviously you practice for penalties as yeah. well, but is there anything you do against the opposition goalkeeper that you spot or anything? Um, I can't give that away, <laughs> so just yeah, in yeah. case someone watches it. But yeah, I usually have a routine that I usually do that um, works for me. Yeah. The, the second goal as well, I mean, you yeah. couldn't get uh, I mean, any, any more than a, than a tap in really for that one. Yeah, yeah, I mean, obviously we work, we work on it a lot with um, Webby and obviously the gaffer. You know, obviously they... Um, advised me a lot of the times just be in and around the box and you know be sharp be ready and for anything that lands around so luckily I was there and I tapped it in. Let's have a look at the third one as well what happened there because <laughs> it, I mean it was a uh, I mean you stumbled inside the six yard box well you, you describe what happened. Yeah literally I think um, I don't know one of the boys shot and then um, obviously it parried off their centre back so I don't know I've just been there in front of the goal so I, t I tried touching it around the keeper but as I've touched it he's actually kicked me right. which was actually quite bad but luckily as I was stumbling I had to touch it in yeah just to make sure that we get the goal. And you're happy to get the match ball as well uh, of course your second hat-trick of the, of the season as well so how do you how do you feel about that? Yeah delighted 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 I mean as a forward all you want to do is you know score as many goals as possible and try to help the team improve you know first and foremost we got the win which was most important obviously is a bonus to take the match ball home. 16 goals this season, 7 in 5 I think it is uh, in the last 5 games. I mean um, obviously you, you, I think we spoke before and you set yourself a target, is that target been broken? Um, not yet, not yet obviously there's still a lot of games to be played for obviously I know the target that I need to get to before January to sort of help me push on you know the second half of the season to try and get as much as possible but you know I've just got to be in and there, there around you know try to help the boys and you know get the victory and then the goals will come. In January of course the um, you manager says that you're happy at this this football club yeah. uh, is that how you how you feel it? Yeah yeah definitely definitely I mean I'm loving my time here I'm enjoying my time fans have taken me on well obviously I've settled obviously I've got a place here now so it's easier for me to sort of just fo um, focus on my football side of the game and concentrate on that and hopefully bring success to the club. A big crowd almost here today as well, almost 6,000 as yeah, well. How yeah. do you feel about that? Yeah, great, great. I mean, obviously, they give us a big lift during these sort of moments. Obviously, as you can see, they, they were chatting on, you know, singing throughout, throughout the whole game. That gives us a massive lift. Us as boys, obviously, it helps us, drives us on, you know, to keep, you know, doing well and keeps improving us to try to get the wins for him. Quite a few partners up front this season. Yeah. Stephen Payne came on as well, and yeah. and uh, uh, obviously, I mean, you've got quite a few goals still left in you this season, haven't you? <laughs> yeah, yeah. I mean, wh whether the gaffer plays me, obviously, last time in, in the FA Cup, he played me in the ten, still managed to score. But we literally just have to, you know, we've got a very, very good group. So everyone that gets put on the pitch has to just do their best, and you know, as long as we get the win, you know, that's all that we're after. So we're just going to have to keep focusing on that. Solid hold next week. Obviously, yeah. another tough ask for you. Um, uh, again, you'd expect the side to go there with full of confidence. Yeah, definitely, definitely. I mean, we've got a very good group. Um, we have to first of all enjoy this win today, and then um, you know the gaffer's going to get us working from next week and hopefully get us preparing to win that game as well.